I can evaluate things differently. I can like milk one day and I can not like milk another day. It's not liking milk more. Donated one hundred dollars. Apart Thank from you. sex happening with only one person, it does not change the fact that you had sex fluid. fifty times. And yet, women feel the need to lie about it, and men too expect you to lie to them. Brian, I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I'm morally fluid now. So what do I know? Thank you, uh, Tamara, 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 Tamarama, Tamara. Uh, I want. I don't want a woman to lie to me. I want to know. I want to take the red pill. Like, tell me you have a body count of hundred, so that I don't date you. Oh, you're talking with the chat. Yeah, no. Is it something that you ask, like actually, like why do you care? It's like the first question I ask. Why? Like. Wait, I've why do I care? Yeah, here we're I gonna move it on. But what, so, what's your question? Like, why would you care? Like, why would I care? Yeah, it's the past, whatever. Like, would you, I, I feel okay, like I'll ask you a question. Uh, would you date a man who previously slept with men? No, but. Wait, hold, no. hold on. Well, I gotta use your logic here. It's the past, right? No, okay, but I'm th- I, I'm talking about like the body count. Like I'm not talking about the your sexuality. Like if you're yeah, let's say he's bisexual. Yeah, I would not date a bisexual for like. But what my... if yeah? But he he stopped being bi. But you can't stop being bi. Hillary Epstein you donated one hundred dollars. So you can't. Desiree, how can you, you can't justify your promiscuity when the three men that are on your of postings all have wedding rings? Yikes. Enabling immorality, Earl. No clue how Earl. you can justify being Earl. a harlot. That's not true. Earl. The uh, only Hillary, married thank guy you. I, I have on there was the guy that, that I was like in an open relationship with. Thank you. Other appreciate than that, it. it's just other. Um, well, actually, I did make content with a married couple, so they would have rings, but it was like a That's nage great. Uh Thank Sorry. you, Hillary. One thing before we keep going, I have to go. My kids are waiting downstairs. Um, I can okay. leave my notes. Sure. That's that. fine. Yeah. Wait, wait, um, wait. I, I know you might think that it's immoral to leave your kids downstairs, but you should just be morally fluid. Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> my bad. I should. Clearly. Yeah. yeah. Well, uh, thank yeah. you for coming. Because Appreciate it. to meet yes, you, by the way. Have a nice night. It's nice to meet you. Thank you. Because obviously, I'm the arbiter of all things moral. Yeah. Well, wait me up yeah. with that one. There you go. Uh, just you, you can just leave it there. That's that's fun. No uh, yeah. Thank night, you for everyone. coming. Have a good night. night. Thank you for coming. Uh, so going back to your thing, what was it? Yeah. yeah like, why would you care? It's the what, past. Like, why would you care? Like, what what does it add to your to your so, thinking like about when it comes to body count. Yeah, like you ask it, and what like she said, I don't know, thirty, or she said mm. fifty, or she said five. Like, what? I does, would be what more. It yeah, it's, it's pretty you? simple. It's pretty simple. I would be more attracted to her if it was lower, and but I'd why? be less attracted to her if it was higher. Why? It's like it's. Let me ask so, you a question. It's so it's so like for me like. You go through a lot of phases in your life, mm-hmm. I think. Sure. So, like, there's a, f- a phase where you're, like, m- more going around, looking up or whatever. Or yeah. there's a phase where you don't want to do it. Like, it's it's just normal. So, human development. Kind of Wait, hold on. I mean, no, no, I don't no. care. But like, so, you can... oh, go ahead. No, go ahead. I don't know. Like, I feel like it doesn't add anything to the relation. So what do you mean it doesn't add anything to the like relationship? If I, if, I, if, I meet, if I meet you and I know that thing, it doesn't add anything. Like, it doesn't add something. It doesn't like change the, anything. Yeah. It doesn't change anything. Yeah, or, or even, like, so are you, are you, so, I don't want to know. Like, I don't care. Yeah. It's your thing. Sure. I mean. Well, are you saying that uh, you are who you are and, like, if you meet this individual, whether they have a body count of five or of 50, it doesn't actually. I mean, they are who they are. It's not going to change who they are. Who they are yeah, as a person. Yeah, like it's not an important thing. I don't. I don't. For you. Care. Yeah. For well, you me. don't care. So just to be clear, well, yeah, I, I'll explore that, and we'll have the back and forth. But so, if a guy told you that he had slept with, uh, well, let's get a split yeah. going on this, if we can. Yeah. Uh, sorry, guys. One sec. So, mm-hmm. if a guy told you that he had slept with a thousand women before you. Not a problem for you? No. Okay. Actually, I mean, a thousand. I mean, you're, you're extremely, like, you're putting in the... Ex- sure, like, I am. Too but, much. But you agree that but there is a point. I'm, I'm talking you're, about you're the agreeing. normal. Like, oh, so, so, so normal. No. 
you know, like the, a thousand, it's, I mean, okay. I'm not talking about the extreme numbers. I'm talking about- But if it, if it like doesn't matter at all, then wouldn't it also not matter if it's a hundred? Is a no, hundred extreme, I, I but is a hundred extreme? No, no. It, like, it would ever, like, I don't okay, so I don't want to know. I don't want to know at all. <laughs> like, why why don't you want to know? Because I, I would think it bother, it's Would private. it bother you? No, because I think it's like a private thing. It's your thing. I, I and it doesn't like, it's not conversation, like an important conversation. It's not something, I add me something. Well, you don't care yeah. about it. Yeah, me. I'm talking about But you do kind of care about it because when I give you the extreme example, you do kind of care about it. No. So a thousand body count? For the guy, don't care? No, I don't care. You wouldn't care. No. So here, let me frame, a, frame the question differently. You find out the guy you're interested in has slept with three other women that week. Is that a problem? Mm. Yeah, maybe. But it, so like, no, it depends. Like, like it depends. It depends. I, of what I want. Like what do you if want? If I want to stay with him or, for, or, or if I want to just hook up with him. So like... Well, I, if honestly, I'm using him, if I'm using both him, of I these, don't even, I mean, like, even if you, I feel like in both, even if you just wanted to fuck once, or if you wanted a relationship, yeah, but you, you both of these know. are kind of terrible because yeah, but this you, man, you never know. Like if you hook up with someone, you don't know what what he's. They might like, lie. They, they might, might lie. lie. They might. But don't they could say, also like, tell you, you the you truth. You don't talk about that. But they could also tell you the truth. Yeah. Which is what you would hope for, right? Yeah. Right. But so let's assume ig ignoring this component of, well, they could lie. Let's assume that you know, right? Mm -hmm. Let's say, assume that they're forthcoming and then tell you the truth. Would you feel comfortable sleeping with a man? No. If he fucked a girl an hour before no. you? Why not? Is it gross? Yeah. Yeah. So that's how men <laughs> feel that gross feeling. That's how men feel in general about women's promiscuity. But so, because, so but if you do it, like if, because I had, uh, like, um, with my ex-ex-boyfriend, we talk about that, and but his why? number was lower but than mine, and he got, like, all the relationship was about that one, that thing. Like, oh, no, you slept with that. that you had so his it matters to, it mattered and, to him. Yeah. Yeah. And it was, like, that's just, like, a ego thing, because my number was higher than yours, and, like... So, so basic, like, so, so, how do you say, like, masculine thing, like. Oh, like, a, it was like an masculine, ego. He was yeah, a, ego thing. Ma like, machismo yeah, type thing. Machismo. He couldn't handle it. So. It's, no, it's not about, he couldn't yeah, because handle like, it. If, if, you, if you stay with someone, like, with a girl that. Hail and well met. Lol Paladins donated one hundred dollars and two cents. That is Brian, true. Brian, you are forgetting that a man who has slept with three other women this different. same week makes him more desirable to women. Go back to the by analogy because that gives her the. Ick. That is a fair point no. because there is a differential here between men and women. So, like, a man who's capable of sleeping with a lot of women, even if you as a woman have like an aversity to promiscuity in men. Like, you will at least acknowledge that men who are capable of sleeping with a lot of women, they typically are going to be more attractive. Nah, I disagree in total. But yeah. Whereas yeah. women, that doesn't make you more attractive, your ability to like sleep with a lot of dudes. I don't, I don't think so. You, wait, I mean, are you, you don't think so as in you agree or you disagree? No, I disagree. Like, it's the same. It's totally the same. Wait, you, so do you think that it's just as easy for men and women to get sex? No, it's so much easier for a woman. For a woman to get yeah. sex. Right. So then it's more impressive. Because they decide. Men. Yeah, like women are the end. deciders. Yeah. More, more, most of the time. Most of the time, Not yeah. always, but like. Yeah. But and I don't so, think that you're, you get some points because you hook up with. Well, the, the difference is, is like, for example, so let's say if guys were looking at a, uh, an attractive girl, mm. but she, they knew that she had just slept with like three men, like most men are going to be yeah, really turned off no, by but, that. But me too. Sure, but it's a, there's a bit of a different difference here. Mm. So why? I think women care far less than men do when it comes to body count. And you said you don't care, but you dated a guy who did care. But I don't. But think so why? But, but you I said. Think but your original. That's good. Like but, I don't think that's normal. But like you should not be like this. What should not be like this? It should not be that. You should not that care. Girl, no, it should be like something that 
it's not on like different levels when you talk when you say oh i mean i'm not saying that male promiscuity is good i'm just saying it's different like women don't seem to care that much about it Mm. Some do. So, uh, but, I care. Yeah, but, s- some do, and I'm sorry. Uh, you don't care. I care. You care. Okay. I, I think it's it depends because I met I met guys that do, doesn't care that don't care. Yeah, some guys don't care. So I've literally probably, never been asked. Truthfully, though, yeah, I mean, me. if a guy does care and he's asking you about it, it's for the ego. No, well, yeah, I mean, the totally, point. The point. Totally of, hold on, just ego. let me finish. So right. the point I was trying to make here is that if a guy does ask you this question. It's actually kind of a green flag because he's vetting you for long-term commitment. So if a guy just wants to fuck you, if a guy just wants to fuck you, most guys won't care. No, They'll just I've like whatever. I've been in a relationship without this question. Yeah. I, okay, I've never sure, found it to matter to relationships. That's not what I'm arguing. So, um, I, I do... Shit, I lost it. Uh, you said... Uh, getting back to your original point, though, you said the past doesn't matter. So I do want to kind of get back to this. Like, why would you not date a guy who experimented with men let's say no, he's I, i'm talking no you're misunderstanding like, no but I'm you said the past about, doesn't matter yeah, the past doesn't matter in yeah i'm testing I, your logic talking about how many girls you hook up with not talking about everything because if it's everything the past doesn't matter you can murder someone oh, no it doesn't matter obviously it doesn't but it, i'm, it does I'm trying to give you so the reason i'm bringing up the like bisexual example mm. is the way you might feel about like a guy who previously slept with men and like how it makes you feel, that's the way men feel when it comes to uh, female I don't think that represents every man though because uh, there's plenty of men yes, that I know. That's I know. That. Yeah, there's all kinds of guys. I'm talking in general. Well, anyway, I, I honestly don't think in general guys care. I really don't. I think you have like a niched opinion and you have followers that follow your opinion, but there's a whole no, other No, I'm world prepared out there. to say the majority of men care. There's Stop enough men. There's enough men who don't care. I think because they're desperate for pussy. No, I think it's it's, that it's the contrary. Like the the people with a little bit of insecurities, they ask you how many guys, blah 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 blah. Why is it insecure? It's insecure because they're like, oh no, man, I'm going with a slut. I'm going with that, blah blah blah. If you like someone, like. Yeah, if you like somebody, if, you, you should. If you're mature if you, enough, if like you're to ma- know that you had a life before. <laughs> With some Do you think um, w- w- you, uh, y- if you had a man, you'd want him to be a mature man, right? Yeah. Do you think that mature people set boundaries? Yeah. And so, do you? And do you think responsible people set boundaries? Yeah. So, if a responsible and mature man sets a boundary, and the boundary is he doesn't want a woman who has more than X amount of sex partners, no, how could he be insecure? It's totally up of him. Well, like, how could that be insecurity if that's what your expectation is, is that he has boundaries? No. I. Well, it's such you, a couple of decades ago perspective, to be honest. Yeah, I, think I mean, I too, think, I to me, that I've in, had men ask me more like how many dads of my kids I have and things like that. Uh, to me, the modern man cares more about like what baggage do you have in your life that's going to affect me? And so, the more yeah. men you've slept with, the more baggage well, you tend to have. Well, not necessarily because, yes. I mean, you don't necessarily take doesn't... baggage with you from every experience yeah. you have. A lot of experiences yeah, but, are very positive. Desiree, it was fun. It was Desiree, what it was. Desiree, how could it be insecure, though, to set boundaries? I no, never said that. I wasn't saying that at that's all. Like, totally I was simply making the point that, that, that not every man well, then, well, how would that be insecure? I don't understand. You I said it's that, insecure that's a boundary. for a man. Like, if, you, if you don't want to, like, stay with someone, I mean... It's a standard. I think I, I if, don't feel like it's a standard. Yeah, but how can Whoa, wait, wait, hold on. Like, hold that's, that's what I think. Like, I don't how is think. it not a standard? I here's my standard. I don't want to date a woman who's promiscuous or who has a promiscuous it's not promis- past. Why promiscuous? Like, wait, okay. Know. So what is so promiscuous? Isn't there grace promiscuous for like, sleeps with a lot of people. Isn't if there she has a high body for count. how she was maybe raised so in a nope. different culture than you? Oh, oh, maybe. Nope. How would she know not to sleep with? People? I don't need to give anybody grace. Women reject men all the time for a, lot, be- a wide variety but, but of reasons. But I'm just saying, not every man is like Y'all, you. A you lot don't of wanna, men you, no, 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 stop, stop. Stop! 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 You don't want to. You don't want to date a guy because of his height, because of his money, because of X, Y, Z. 
But all of a sudden, when men say, I don't want to date a woman because of this. That's fair. Well, all I'm of a sudden, like that, but all of a sudden, oh, like it's insecure. That. It's insecure. It's controlling. It's how blah, blah, blah. high, yeah. how high yeah, is your body count? Like, what, what's not like. I don't know. Tell, what, tell me yours. Like, no, like, tell me, tell like, me yours. for you. No, what's tell, tell, too me much. Yours. No, tell me no, yours. Tell me yours. Tell me yours. No. What are, well, wait, that, are you but insecure? Tell me, like, wait, 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 hang on. No, are you, I'm, I'm wait, really wait a second, wait just, a second. Just respond. Why won't you way. tell us? Are you insecure? Are you insecure? No, it's about private. About your body count? It's private. I don't want to say that. I thought body count doesn't matter, though. <laughs> okay, hang on. It, it sounds like you're being insecure. No, why? You're saying, can you answer me? Like, can you answer me? You can answer what, me? Why question? aren't you being insecure right now? It uh, sounds like insecurity. What's too high? Like, it's too high, like, for Depends you. Depends on the age, right? Depends on the age. But look, I honestly, once you start getting. Uh, uh, so is it like higher than uh, yours? Or is over, it like. So, okay, I would say over 10 okay. is, is getting high. Okay. It's not necessarily a deal breaker. Okay. But the strong preference for lower, so okay. I would prioritize trying to date a woman with a lower body count. Okay. Over 10, not necessarily a deal breaker. Over 20, that's like major red flag territory. Mm -hmm. I would say uh, over 30, certainly a deal breaker. But I mean, over 20, okay. probably a deal breaker. Is it based on yours or is it based on like in general? What like, do you mean? Like, is it ba based on your body count? Or is it? No, not at all. Okay, in general. Not at all. Okay. In now fact, I don't think, I actually don't think there, if, if a man has a high body count, mm -hmm. I don't think there's actually anything wrong with him wanting a woman with a low body count or even a virgin. Even, even if women they have like emotion. a big body count? Even if the guy has a big body count, no problem okay. at all Can with I him realizing. In, in like the contrary, I would say like the, uh, the reverse. What like do you mean? Like, yeah, well, well like here I can, girl. yeah, what? I can actually explain this concept to you, right? So. Um, do you like men who are taller than you? Yeah. Okay. Do you think that men generally like women who are shorter than them? Yeah. Okay. Well, well I don't understand why you accept that double standard. But, but like, it's not the same. Yeah, that's right. It's not the same. Okay, so the so question, saying, so the question, so the question so you becomes: say that a girl doesn't. Yeah. If a man, if a man is tall. Mm -hmm. And he prefers a short woman. A woman is short and prefers a tall man, right? Okay. Well, I don't understand. They have totally different preferences here, but that's somehow okay. But if a man has a large body count but prefers a woman with a, uh, a lower body count, why is that suddenly wrong? No, no, I didn't say that it's wrong. I didn't say it's wrong. I said that I, like, there are people that don't care, people that care, and I don't think it's, that important for me. I'm always yeah. talking for me. So like, yeah. So well, I'm just close. saying. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm just. I'm just saying. No, uh, if you, if you, if you ask Brian, if you ask Brian, um, you seem like you were skeptical. You were like, "Hey, wait a second. No, why was, is it okay was, for no, you? Was, wait, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Why was, is it okay for you to have, have let, like, let's say Brian slept with 500 women, mm, right? He say, hasn't, but let's just say he had. Wait, hold on. Maybe. And, Go okay. Ahead. Okay. No, well, okay. No, six thousand women. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's say he had slept with six thousand women. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, and he wanted a woman who had slept with no women. Thank you. Why? Why is that I, actually a problem? No, it's not a problem. But I think I think it's a little bit like. Uh, in, uh, I don't know the word in English. I'm Hip sorry. Hypocrite. But in, yeah. Hypocrite. Like a yeah. double standard. Yeah. yeah because that, like, what, think, like think you, it's don't do, you don't for do you to want to date a taller want... man. No. What? Then it's hypocritical for you to want to date someone taller than you. No, that's totally different. Well, totally so different. why is it different? It's different. <laughs> why is it different? It's different. Come on, no, you can say it's the it, same. It's different. You why? can say it's the same. Nah, come on. But so, so let me ask you this question, right? So, uh, in order for you to want to be with someone, do you need to be exactly no. the same? No. But right. I'm saying that if you sleep with 500. Girls or whatever, and you want the one that does, yeah. yeah. I think is it's a little bit too much. Yeah, come on. No, I think it's totally I, I, fine. I, I think, think it's, it's totally no, fine. It's a little bit like totally fine. Well, here's why, right? And you and all the um, Muslims, or what's the guys that? Right. Isn't there like a 
religion that they have all you their wives. You know when you say like, I treat you well, I want all the you to treat me well. Here, let her speak. So if you want, like, I, I treat you well in a, in a relationship. So I want you to treat me well too. So like, you know the, I don't know, we say this thing, like you do some, you act like, no, like you want to be treated. Is it, do you say mm -hmm. like that? I mean, I, I think in this, lines like in this fra phrase so but then it's up yeah, to you but, like you can this, keep like yeah i get what you're whatever. saying yeah i understand what you're saying you're saying you should treat people how you want to be treated right yeah kind of the the golden rule and right the, yeah, gold, and, the golden rule mm -hmm. yeah but but here's the thing um would you agree with me that more women will allow themselves to be anally penetrated than men what what? The fuck? Out of well, nowhere, grant, bro. Grant that that's true. Yeah. I guess. Okay. That's why I yeah. so, so, right, right, right. So, so here's the thing. It's crazy. I, it's crazy. Where I'm going with this, what, what I'm trying to kind of get you to intersect with is, if you were with a man mm. who wanted to do that with you, mm. but did not want you to do that with him, is he being a hypocrite? <laughs> but here we're finding like the only thing I have that one. I got some. Well, just answer me. Just answer me. Yeah. Is he being yeah, a hypocrite? You're right. you're right on this. You're right. It's fine. I have some. If, if someone so told wait, me, wait, no, 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 no. But no, I have the right to say no. You, I have the right to say no too. To here, I got a couple. What? I have a couple. So, so, okay. Do you think, for example, is a woman wrong mm -hmm. if she's poor but she's attracted to rich men? Is she wrong? No, but it should be like the same on the other side. What do you mean? Like if a girl that's poor, she's attracted from uh, a, a rich guy or a poor guy, it's attracted to like a rich girl, it's the same. Like, no? I but, don't know, maybe it's a... But is it wrong? No, it's not wrong. But she, she does not possess the trait in which she desires in a partner. So she you can, doesn't. You can like I think that you can do whatever you want. Like you can desire a girl that doesn't. Hook but you, okay, up with you're saying like you're virgin, saying but... wrong for man with bot, high body count to want a virgin, right? That's what you're saying. Yeah, it's like it's not it's not wrong. It's uh, hypo hypocrite, hypo a, hypocritical, hypocritical, hypocritical. Yeah, yeah. hypocritical. Okay. Well, you object oh, to it's it. A, it's hypocritical. But, but um, so so to have the back and forth. Uh, and so, I, okay, then it's hypocritical for a poor woman to be attracted. Not to be, to want, like, to want. a fact, like, to want a rich guy, yes. So then, it, but so. It, okay, so, but it's not hypocritical for men who have 500 body counts to be attracted to virgin women. Yeah, it is. It's hypocritical to be attracted. No, to be attracted, no. No, like, but to you'll want. Okay, so to, we'll, no, we'll use be, the term want. You are attracted to... You can't change that, right? You can't. Okay, yeah. but then you can so, choose actually. So, do people typically want what they're attracted to? No, no, always. Not always. Nah, nah. You, you. Okay. Get, well, I'll just use. Like, so maybe, I'm just, just going to use. Brian. Maybe just me, but I don't choose who. Like I got like the click. I don't know how to say sure. it. So, but like, you want. If I fell in love with someone, right. it's not because okay, he so has everything that. I'm I not going to even use uh, the term attracted. Then I'm going to use the term want. Mm. Right. So, okay, men who are, have a high body count, they want a woman with a low body count or who are virgin. So a woman who's poor wants... But, and then if you... Like, hold if on, you, just let me finish. Yeah, sorry. Who wants a rich man. Is that wrong? I'm not saying it's wrong. I'm saying that so it's... So it's, it's hypocritical. Okay, so, it's hypocr yeah. so then it's hypocritical for women who are poor to want to date rich men. Is it hypocritical? If, if she wants to uh, date only this kind of man, yes, I think so. Okay. It okay. Is. Well, uh, so. I feel like Brian didn't didn't uh, reveal his ultimate argument, but I remember all of Brian's arguments, and this one's a good one, so I'm going to use it real quick. And I just want to ask you a question. Mm -hmm. um, would you date a man ever in your life who had been with two women at once? Yeah. Would you date a man in your life who had been with multiple men? No. 
Oh, what kind of fucking hypocrite are you? What kind what? of fucking well, hypocrite? I think I want, you that's hypocrite! A, no, that's unbelievable a, hypocrisy! Oh, yeah, that's a Wait a second! Wait a second! But why? I don't oh want to gosh. date with someone that, well, like, I, what is hypocrite? Wait, wait. Doesn't hypocrite mean that you hold two different standards? But she's One not for bisexual. you. You're hang not, on, hang on. A hypocrite is right? is you hold a standard for you, right? And uh, or you hold a separate standard for yourself that you hold for other people. So in this particular case, yeah. right? If it's a same sex relationship, why is that okay for you but not for him? No, no, no. It is no, no. I I thought that you said like. To date a guy that was with multiple guys. Yeah, he's with multiple guys. Yeah, no, but because I'm straight and I want to date someone yeah, straight. But, uh, wait, wait. If he's with multiple, if he's with multiple women, why is that a problem or no, it's not, not a problem? A problem. Because, yeah, because why I is want, it not a problem? I want to date someone straight. Done. Well, wait. He's still. Wait, wait, wait. I don't understand. Would you ever engage in same-sex activity with a guy? What? what? Sorry. What? Would you ever engage in a threesome with a guy where you were with another chick for a guy? Yeah. But you would yeah, not I accept don't. that from a guy. But wait, See, you would not accept that from a guy. Yeah. One hundred dollars. Yeah. <laughs> if you won't date a girl because she's fat, it's body shaming. What? Yet women have no problem calling a guy working on fries at McDonald's a loser. Pure feminine chaos. Yeah. yeah thank so, you. So, so what I'm saying is just this. If you would be willing to engage with a woman, you would be. But you're not willing to engage with a man who's been with a man. Yeah, in a how threesome, are you not, are you how are you not like, hang on, how are you not a hypocrite? How is that not are hypocritical? Are you talking about like a, a, tre, uh, yeah. a treason? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Tre treason? Is it, do you say that? Treason? No. Yeah, yeah, threesome, a threesome. Yeah. Oh, yeah. treason. Treason. Well, whatever. Yeah, I would accept it. Treason. Him to be with a treason with a guy, so don't but do not unless you're Trump. Straight. Wait, not you know what one. I mean? So you would be with a man who's fucked other men? I would. I think I that we're, we're going all over like, of the. No, we're not going all over the place. You would be with a man who's fucked other men? No. No, but you would. But if you fucked other women, would you expect a man to be with you? No. 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 If he, he, no, he, okay. it depends. It depends on him. Like if he's fine Wait, with the you, thing that. Have you I, been with women? No. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. it, like if he's fine would with you, the thing well, that you, I'm bisexual, would you ever be with fine. a woman? Hang on. Would you ever be with a woman? No. No. I'm just too no straight. woman like, in sorry. the whole world. Like if you could pick any woman. Mm, I'm sorry. Like, Wait, let's go. Know, we should. Not, we should. Let's go around the table. What's everybody's body count starting with Desiree? No, it's I would say about like eight to ten guys. You're a fucking liar. <laughs> that, well, my dad. No fucking way, bro. My dad raised me to be a prostitute, oh, so my. I was with a lot of people. I was with about probably twenty people. That wasn't necessarily my choice, but it was like your the dad. Path. That was. Yeah, my dad raised so me. So you're to be a sex you're worker. you're. Non accountability body count is eight. And I would say eight to ten. Eight to ten guys. That was like authentically my choice. Yeah. I was married for. You're a, long a time. fucking liar! You're a fucking liar! And then I remember I was that whole stint of religious after my childhood trauma. Haven't you had sex with like three men on your OF? Yeah, that's three men. I was in a long term relationship with Bro, one. The math is not math in here. Hold on. Multiply it by three, and that's the real number. Why isn't the math working? What do I make this sense? is like you have I was married for it's 10 like years. I was with the same guy for about 10 years. Before that, I did a, like a long stint of celibacy when I was super religious. And I had kind of a... Super religious? Um, well, I lost my super virginity religious? very young with my dad's... Okay. You know, Vivian, what about what you? Is. Wait, oh, don't get it. You got to stay for this segment. Stay for the segment. <laughs> Stay for the second. Come answer. on. No, no. <laughs> Como se dice? Ah, you're good. Como se dice? Uh, body count in uh, <laughs> Italiano. <laughs> Papa Italiano. Okay, uh, Vivian, body count. Five. Damn, bro, it was three last time. <laughs> Vivian, power power <laughs> level increasing, Brian. Power, power level increasing. Fucking thing. Huh? <laughs> <You're over. laughs> 
Mm. All right, what about you, Jade? Two. Jade? What? Two. Multiply it by three, and that's the real what number. Is no. What is this? <laughs> what is this? Is this a gaming thing? This is this a VR? A oh, okay, well, uh, let, me ask you, you ask you, let me ask you, Jade, a quick follow up. I gave you my lore. Yeah. Let us assume for a second that it wasn't just two, right? Okay. If it wasn't, if it wasn't, would you tell us? Yeah. You wouldn't lie? No. No no matter what, you wouldn't, right? No. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay. I gave you my backstory. Uh, I'm Burn not going to say that. Burn the dead. Though. I don't even know where I am. I arrived here in the United States since three days. I don't even know like where is going this. Where I'm going, like on body body oh, count. Not gonna say that. Give a how about a range? Will you do a range? Okay. More I than say 10? more than ten. I say yeah, more than ten. More than twenty? No. More than fifteen. I'm not gonna more say anything. 15? I'm not gonna Wait, say more anything. More than fifteen? I'm not gonna say anything. <laughs> I already I already said enough. Morgan, it's your turn. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> hey uh, uh, Brian, that scanner's going fucking crazy, bro. That scanner's going crazy. Morgan? I've said it. Oh, is it x ray vision? One. Is it one? Yeah. Um, like, I think 14. 14? Two. What's yours? <laughs> Go ahead, Brian. <laughs> Hey, Brian, um, no, you want to you you make it one not. more? Uh, my scouter is detecting that you, some of you are not being forthcoming on the body count question. Why do you guys always think we're lying? And this scouter, that shit, like this Nobody is some fucking next science, technology. Uh, that is, uh, is Saiyan technology. And uh, they have some of the most brilliant scientists in the world, including Kakarot's father, is yeah. what I'm told. Bardog. Bar so, yeah. Bardog. I remember... Bardock, he tried to fight Frieza. Didn't go so well. Save planet Vegeta. Anyways, uh, look, you know, look, uh, I'm not going to press it, but I think some of you guys are not being, uh, you know, totally uh, honest. Oh, really quick. So, okay. I'll, I'll give you like a list of 10 examples where it's like women want things in men that they don't possess, right? Mm -hmm. They want traditional men, but they're not traditional. They want charismatic men, yet they are not charismatic. They want tall men, but they're not tall. Mm -hmm. They want chivalry, but they're not chivalrous. They want exciting men, but they're not exciting. They want strong well, men, but they're wrong. not strong. That's hold on, wrong. hold on. They want dominant men, but they're not dominant. They want men to take initiative, but they don't take initiative. They want men to chase them, but they don't chase. They want men to ask them on dates and pay for them, but they don't do the same. They want confident men, but they're not confident themselves. Many shy women want men who are not shy. Single mothers who don't want to date single fathers. Uh, it seems like women Can want I to ignore, you? hold on, it seems like women want to ignore all the double standards and unfairness that benefit them. But when there's a double standard or, not, or unfairness that benefits men, really only a very small percentage of men, uh, because most men don't have access to hookup culture. Uh, it's just kind of... So interesting. What kind of man do you Oh, mean? funny. Like, Women what, want. If you're, hold you're, on. Who this is the are, best one. No, wait. Well, who, who come are you, on. Who hey, are you geez. describing? Who are you describing? Who am I describing? Who? I don't know. I, who? What I do you mean? Like that. Do you so, want a guy who's funny? Know. You want a funny guy? I'm so funny. I, I'd say you are funny. <laughs> no, I think I a lot want, of women. I want a guy that, like, you talking for to example, me? something that you're... You think <laughs> I'm funny? <laughs> no, no but, like, something that you read, like... What do I read? Um, I want a guy that take the, like, take me out. Yeah, take the initiative. That, yeah, yeah, I am a, a girl that does all this wanna, stuff. Yeah, so, like, course. I don't want... I don't oh, okay. trying oh, to find shit. Oh, Hold look, on. okay, well then, well, then, here, we can make it even more nuanced, right? <laughs> Uh, do you like men with beards? No. Shit. Okay. Do you like men with long nails? Damn, bro. Wait, what? Wait, what? Bro, why? Do you, you like men with long nails? Damn, bro. Well, like, Throw me under the bus. No. Yeah. Do you like men with uh, long, long nails? Na no. No. Well, but you have long nails. Ah, oh, come on. Who don't you're putting, oh, like, you're putting in... You're, you're, I'm just, you're coming I'm just up saying, with like, something can, that doesn't. This, this, add what I'm saying to you is that the 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 idea here is I have a beard. Is no that I like the beard. endless amount of double standards goes on and on and on and on, 
And I think that it's fine. I think but that it's fine say, that women you have. You can say that. On, one, one. I think it. I think it's fine for women to have different standards than men. I think that that's totally fine. But when women say there's a double standard, and then pretend like there's not two different standards, that's when I have a problem. No, of course, of course, there are like different things that people like a guy, like a, a man wants different things from a from a woman, and right. But including body count, yeah, that's, <laughs> including that's, body count, yes, right? <laughs> yes. But like, uh, I don't think that like I would never pretend something from the other person that I don't do. Hmm. Talking about yeah, me. you, uh, yeah, you would, don't me. you want? Not wait, the long wait, names. Come on, the long names. It's a that is not. Thing. Listen, Stupid. that is not true. That is not true. Do you wear makeup? That's just the appearance. I'm talking about the, the way how to, uh, you act. Hang on. Do the you way wear you... makeup? Yeah. Do you want a man who wears makeup? No. So do you, okay. You, do you, you have long hair? Do you no, want a man who wants long point. hair? You have breasts. Do you want a man who has breasts? Like it just goes on and on and on and on. So when you say, I don't expect that a man for me would ever have to do a thing that I don't do. Not That's just to do everything that true. I do. I mean, I, I'm talking about the way, like, you are in the relationship. I'm not talking about the appearance. I'm not talking about, like, stupid stuff. I'm not that superficial. Like, I'm talking about if... Because he read a lot of things, like, I'm the charismatic, the whatever it was... I'm talking about these things. I'm not talking about the nail polish. I'm not talking about the makeup. So that was my point. So you expect but, the man to be point, able to have... But if you're, if you're coming out with your point, you're mm -hmm. right. So, so if you, do you expect the man to have children in the relationship? I'm not going to answer. I'm sorry. Yeah, they, I mean, that's not the... Like, they can't do that, right? Uh, yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, they, they can't do that. So the thing is, like, you wouldn't have that expectation, right? Yeah. So within the relationship itself, there's going to be different standards just based on that, right? Yeah, I'm gonna, yeah ba based on the nature, I guess. Yeah, just based on the nature. There's going to be different standards just based on the yeah. nature. So even no, the idea, no, even on other things, even the idea of expectation when it comes to the relationship standards is going to be different. Yeah. Like, no matter what, yeah, it's going no, to be that's different. That's true. That's true. I, it, it could be that I want something from you that you don't want from me. So it's totally fine. I'm talking about me, what I want, like what I mm -hmm. I trying to find. Okay, so so um, I just want to make sure from from your view, mm -hmm. inside of the relationship, absent any sort of like um, physical necessities, like having children, or you're a woman, he's a man. Mm -hmm. Inside of the actual relationship, you don't want there to be anything that's unequally yoked. You'll never no, no, expect no. a man to work no. if you won't I, I work. I think that there is always like even uh, balance. So if I if I put something in the relationship, it could be that you put something else. But for the basics, like the care, the the importance, or like the mm -hmm. yeah, I mean there are. I think that there are some things that you should put the two of you in the relationship. And then there are others that could be like that <coughs> I'm funnier and you're like, I don't know, smarter, but. Yeah, I, I think I think I understand that. But I, I have to ask us a question. If inside the relationship you want it to be kind of like equal, that's what you're saying, right? You want it to be at least I mean, somewhat you equal. Put, I'm, you have to put the same effort. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. fair. Uh, the middle of the night, it's the middle of the night and you're sleeping with the man of your dreams in the bed mm. and the window breaks mm. and you see on the camera that there are men breaking into the house. Mm. Does he go first? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, I guess so. I don't know. It doesn't. I don't know about all this equal shit. You know, it doesn't sound all that equal to here, me. I got I to gotta move things on. A I got to move things on a little bit here. Um, Last thing on that, though, it seems like last thing, because I forgot to mention this in my whole long list. A lot of women want funny guys, but they're not funny. I could be. Like, so there's kind of a double standard there. Like, I don't hear. You did the I'm not, I'm right not saying that. Then. I'm not Anyways. saying that. Killer of cereal donated $30. $30 TTS. It's roasting time, and that spitter's never looked hotter. 
Get em, ladies and gentlemen. Mm -hmm. Brian, it's tough love time. Stairs are more beneficial than the elevator. Desiree, it's holy true. fuck. It's true. Kill of cereal. Guys, TTS, we've lowered the TTS to uh, 30. We're going to wrap the show up here pretty soon. If you want, get some roasts in or whatever. If you, you guys got to roast me so I can lose some weight. Also, can we maybe a nice comment to uh, Anissa here? Because uh, this, is, uh, this is actually Madison's sister, and she's, um, she's joined the team. She's done a great job tonight helping out with the show. Can we get some W uh, Anissa's in the chat? Am I saying the name right? Yeah. Or am I butchering it? You're good. Okay, I'm getting it right. Guys, <laughs> let's get some W's in the chat for our new team member. Her first uh, stream as, a, uh, as part of the team. She did a great job today. Killed it. She killed it. And, um, yeah, W's in the chat for her. Uh, Big Sass Energy donated $30. Out of here, Mom. Mama Mia, hook it up with this Italian lady. Oh. I need someone to make me brassiole. Papa Del and some Sfogli oh, till I'm, I'm Sicilian. Change it to so Italian. I'm a dirty Italian, but I think she could be Amore Mio. Oh. <laughs> I don't know where any of that shit is. I just, I just know lasagna. That's about it. I'm going to change the TTS voice to uh, the Italian. Thanks, Andrew. The Italian guy. <laughs> Mommy Jim Jim underscore you who donated $30. When Daddy Andrew goes Gior after Brixham's fat, sweaty fun bags, his mommy milkers squirt like this. <laughs> <laughs> and come back like TCH, 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 no, it's like a troll page. There's but does anybody there. actually like fall for it and think there's something there? Because I've been tempted to subscribe because I was just curious if you had anything. We just have there. it. It's just OnlyFans.com. There's like no pictures. There's just nothing there. Wait, you you got you got wait for this part. Oh, actually, go ahead. You got just getting some water. Okay, okay. So is your is uh, your merch for sale in there? Do you have wait, like an Amazon wishlist? So list? we're gonna pull up, guys. We're gonna pull up the Desiree photo or whatever, like the mm. sketch. The soulmate photo. The so soulmate photo, guys. I it's I got this. Soulmate photo sketch you from a freaking yeah. psychic. It was embarrassing. It was before, like a couple right. weeks before I actually came here for the first time. Weird. Bruh. <laughs> That's crazy, dude. That's kind of and, like. And then I came on here and made some sort of weird dying. baby Is girl not slave me, trauma bond with him. That's I don't know you. what the fuck. That's me, That's dude. That's scary. That's weird. That's and I'm just thinking. Okay, maybe That's it's just crazy. like a business partnership <laughs> thing. Maybe it's not necessarily Friends meaning only. it's like a romantic thing. Well. But, <laughs> uh, I mean, I don't know. I didn't yeah. believe in this sort of thing. I, I got a soulmate sketch, actually, fr from a psychic. <laughs> and it was a brunette, dark-eyed, black woman. So it, couldn't, it could, definitely couldn't be you. Okay. Because she's black and had dark hair and black eyes. But I don't really... And, and also was black, right? And also was <laughs> actually black, not fake black like I'm, you. I'm, uh, I'm an albino. I'm an albino. I'm an albino. I'm an albino. Also, please never bring the city back. Ruins it every time. Oh, I'm going to trigger the... <laughs> was that an Italian here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna replay this one. Big Sass Energy donated twenty dollars. Is this Italian? Who kit up with this Italian lady? I need someone to make me bracciole per padelle and some sfogliatelle in Sicilia. So I'm a dirty Italian, but I think she could be amore mio. Now that's, <laughs> that's uh, Gior, that's Giorgio. We're gonna change it to Adriano. It's now Adriano. If anybody wants to uh, send something in Italian. Uh, let's see. What other thing do I have to go over? I think I need to go over while I was tilted tonight, kind of. Uh, I, I think it's worth mentioning. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, I'll probably get interrupted. Uh, so those of you in the chat, do you guys know who Josie is? I'm just going to bring it up just because, yeah, man, they kind of fuck shit up. Vector donated $30. This beauty comes out when she is mild-mannered. 
However, when she starts objectifying herself, I can see Gorlok the Destroyer within. That gives me the I love that girl. I love that girl. My son I want to hear the story. I want to hear the story. My son knows about this show because of Gorlok, and he thought I was cool because he showed me Gorlok, and I was like, "Son, that's the podcast that I go on." And he was like, he had this moment of horror on his face that he was like, "Oh shit." My mother is a big deal. <laughs> I, think my, I think he just thought I was like, I don't know, just frolicking around at the mall or something when I was like, I'm going to this podcast. Mm, yeah. Uh, so, Chad, you guys know this girl, Josie. You guys know Josie. Um, really didn't want to have to talk about this. Uh, but so she's been on the show twice. I think she was last on over a year ago. And she's been asking and asking and asking. She's active in the Discord, um, asking to come back on the show. And I told her, you can come back on if you bring a girl with you who would be good on the show. And she finds a girl, but apparently this girl was not responding to her, but she does not let me know this until, like, 1 p.m. today, and our meet time was 4 p.m. So actually, Desiree, you're not scheduled to be on the show, but because of Josie, I was kind of, kind of... You're desperate. Don't say that. (laughs) I was like trying to find replacements, right? Because the deal with Josie was you can come back on the show if you bring another girl with you. This girl no-shows... Was that Tarzana girl? Was I going to pick her up? No, it was a different girl. So this other girl, she just is no-showing, flaking, whatever. It happens. In addition to this, I don't know, she's having issues with her ride, so she says, I'm going to be late. She says she's going to be 30 minutes late. My understanding, I could be wrong. This is not the most important piece of information with the story, is uh, I think she ends up being an hour late. So she begging. I I, I don't want to. When was this? This was she asked, she's asked me half a dozen times if she could come back on the show. I finally said, okay, you bring a girl with you, she's you can late. come back on the show. And then she's, I believe she ended up being an hour late, right? When was this? Today. So she was here? I, but I told her, I was like, you're going to be late and you're not bringing the girl who so you, you said you were going to bring. Up. So I told her, I was like, just don't come. She shows up anyways, even though I tell her not to, she brings a male with her, and then they start essentially doxing the studio. What does that mean? Oh my God, doxing. So she's like taking photos and videos, just don't, nobody say what, no, 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 hold on, hold on, don't say anything. So she doxes the studio, even though it's her fault she didn't get a spot on the show because she was an hour late. She said she was going to be 30 minutes late. I told her to just not come. Yeah. She promised to bring another girl with her. She, that didn't work. That's like trolling, right? That's like false pretense or whatever. And so they're fucking posting videos, fucking IRL streaming outside of our fucking studio. I don't know how fucking brain dead you have to be to like, not realize we keep the shit private and so she's fucking doxing us essentially so yeah Yeah. that's why i was freaking out like she's fucking doing all this extra shit i told her to not show up to the fucking studio she doesn't show up with the dude she shows up and now she she doesn't show up with the girl she shows up with the dude she's an hour late she starts fucking doing content outside the fucking studio And it's like, how is this? And I told her not to fucking come. Stay in your fucking wherever you're from in L.A. It's so fucking ridiculous that I'm dealing with this shit. So I don't know. Anyways. um, We feel for you, Brian. That does suck. Bro, and she should know better. She should fucking know better. I was not aware of any of this. Yep. It's very rude. And uh, Brian goes through a lot for this platform. That's why I have respect for you. Because it's crazy. I can't imagine dealing with like actually I toaster brain. School. I could not handle beauty school. Literally toaster brain it was level like fucking eighteen year old girls. So like, like if okay. she's a supporter of the show, fucking listen to me. Stay your ass at fucking home. Don't drive over and cause more. It's already a fucking like 
issue doing the show as is without added extra drama. And she shows up on it, essentially disinvited, uninvited. Yeah. And now you're never going to have her on again, right? If she could have, no, and she could have fucking... rescheduled, she could have rescheduled and peacefully come on another time with another girl. Actually fucking, I like, there's stuff that gets me frustrated, but like, I'm already get tilted enough as it is just doing the show, trying to like have the conversations and like for her to fucking show up. It's the most, Oh my God, dude, no, I have no fucking words as somebody who does content. How are you going to fucking show up to where somebody is and fucking live stream your shit right outside and say that, Oh, I'm a, we're a hundred feet away. Fucking toaster brain, dumb fucking shit. Where man. is she? Where is she showing? The... So fucking dumb. She's out of the, is she showing it on her Anyways, platform I, or what is she showing? I didn't want to fucking say anything, but it's like, God damn, bro. Like actually doxing our shit, man. So, sorry. I thought it was a good show. I think we did good. So I think I it guess. was okay. Um, haters going to hate. Haters going to hate. Anyways, I'll let the chats come through. But Leper King Groiper donated $29.99. Your worldview is treat others how they want to be treated but won't date short guys. Do you think they want to be dated or is your arbiter fluid running so low you can't be honest? <laughs> to Italian. Scott <laughs> donated $30. If Desiree's body count is 8 to 10, I nailed Megan Fox in her prime. Oh my god, I think that's my first boyfriend. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Cute. That's cute. Uh, Desiree, nice your one. pronouns are what, the, and fuck. Pronouns? Pronouns. That's like what the, what's the pronoun thing? Oh, I'm like a she, her. Big Sass her, Energy her. donated $30. Her. Can we set a new minimum to silence Desiree when she is on? 100 is a bit too much. It should be 20 max. Wait, what? <laughs> They don't want to pay so much to have mm. my mic. Shut the up. Desiree, your pronouns are what, the, and fuck. All right, thank you. Appreciate it. Tam Tamara, Tamara, Tamara. The Dutch. Appreciate it. Thank you. I Where don't know. It? I'm not sure what that. The pronoun thing though, it's like I'm a woman, so I'm her or she. I don't know Got what a the bunch more coming through categories are. Sorry guys, we're bunch more coming through. One sec. Tell me we donated $30. Body count matters because the higher your bodies is, you will be consciously or unconsciously comparing your partner to your body's best qualities, which make an impossible standard for anyone to uphold. Killer of Cereal donated $30. Anissa, W for holding it down. Desiree, you need not wear anything but a toilet seat around your neck for Halloween. That Don't would, take it to hilarious. heart when the children take the last that piece of hilarious. candy. Run, Brian. Daria donated $30. W. Brixen, W. Andrew. What a great show, yet again. No surprise there. Anyway, is anybody up for watching video. the bow video? Also, to the panel, yeah. would you bow for your man? Do the bow video. It's Josh bad. donated $30. No, Desiree. Your son didn't realize you were a big deal. He realized his mother was an insane narcissistic strumpet who lacks all reason and accountability. Let's face it, he's known for some time too. Mommy Jim Jim underscore you who donated $30. Crapiola. Brixen's fat sweaty mommy milk is malfunctioned. They should have squirted like like this. <laughs> and come back like TSH. You know, I have TSH, a video on my OnlyFans of me squirting TSH, milk. TSH, 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 TSH. Lol Paladins donated $30. Thank you, man. Don't Thank worry, you. Brian. I've had a few failed threesomes before, too. It's yeah, often threesome. not worth it anyway. Never count on a girl to bring another girl. Mm hmm. Word. Giovanni JD donated you, $30. Brian gets desperate when a chick bails and DMs Desiree to come instead. How today, long man. until that same thought no, process occurs I, after I a couple shots at 3 a.m. and his date didn't come home he with him? He did not solicit me. Old man Marine donated $30. A 
Anissa, eyebrows are ten tenths, sorry Morgan. Diarrhea girl, your logic is flawed and life starts and conception, you're being brainwashed. Jade, be more modest and your dating outcomes might change. Legendary Ego donated $29.99. Desiree, did your son see when you said that if he and his sister put out the bad energy that you said Andrew and Brian did, you'd want them off the planet and when pressed, you say dead? Did he? Killer of Cereal donated $30. Brian, I love you man but I can hear your fat underbelly button area growing from here. True, you bro. should do more IRLs to increase your You're step right. count. Do something quick. It's a bit defeating. Yeah. It's, it's you did true. ask for it. It you is did true. Ask for it. Uh, Lucy. <laughs> Lucy. What? You have that girlfriend? I'm going to see her. Like, like Dummy tomorrow. thick donated Wait, you're gonna $69. Wait, you're going to see her tomorrow? Yeah. Hey, no, Desi, how much to see like those you. mommy milkers? <laughs> Trying to see that body wait, wait. Oh Ten dollars. Wait, hold on. My subscription hold on, I got price. That's really a good deal. Wait, so, you so Lucy, Lucy. Nah, she doesn't not like you. I'm they said saying. the girl from Fallout is oh, on oh. your show. People say I look like her. Oh, kind of. Oh. <laughs> a little bit. Yeah. Ish. Wait, you're seeing Lucy tomorrow? Yeah. Uh, doesn't she have COVID? Right. Uh, I'll be wearing a mask and a full hazmat suit. So at Saturday, Saturday, 1.40 p.m., she was scheduled to be on with you again today. Uh, hey, I'm sorry, but just found out I have COVID and don't oh, think wait, I can make I it. I didn't know she actually said that. This is what I deal with every show, guys. I don't know how you freaking do this, Brian. Every show. Oh, <laughs> here's, the, here's the three. I have like two girlfriends because I can't handle this shit. <laughs> Here's the three. I have, I'm sick. Bullshit. Aww. They're not sick. Oh, two, I thought you said you were. I you no. You were sick. Two, fan, vague, they never give details. Vague family emergency. By the way, is uh, is Andrew back or? Do they have kids? Does she have kids? Uh, not yet. Okay. Uh, or my car broke down. That's all the excuses? <laughs> Bro. Well, I think they get scared, Brian. I think it's She's already like been on the show. Well, I mean, why did she? I mean, why would you agree? The second time I came on, I was why having a nervous agree? breakdown. Lu Lucy's a big L. Uh, that is not true. I'm going to defend Lucy to my Sometimes group. there's extra she lied. That she lied about being minute, sick and flaked a day before the show. Oh, well, she's trying to not hurt your feelings, I guess. I'd yeah. rather, honestly, I'd rather somebody just say, fuck you, I don't like your show, I'm not coming, than just you lie. You like honesty. Think I prefer honesty. That, huh? Think of it as that, then. Think of it as that, then? Then why did she... Okay, whatever, bro. Why did she agree to... Uh, Brian's a pretty safe me. guy, to be honest with. That's why I like you, Brian. Uh, okay. To be honest. He'll just tell you, no, I hate you, or I like you. Hey, it's, it's a good quality. Yes. Because you never so... have to wonder where you stand. What's that song by from Eminem? Oh, my God. I feel I'm, like Brian I'm Slim Shady. gets so red-pilled, black-pilled fucking doing this shit. Just like how unreliable people are, and they just lie about you get it. jaded. Do you feel like your criticisms of women has anything to do with what you've experienced from women on this show, or is it just from your personal dating life? What do you, I'm not sure what that even means. Like, do you feel like perhaps stressful or negative or toxic experiences from this show? Like, are you gathering your data about women from that and your dating life, or just purely your personal dating life with women? You know what I'm saying? Because... Uh, like, as an influencer, I would think that it would be hard to delineate the two, right? It would kind of start blending together. You what do you deal mean? With like, so, what the stuff I hear on Well, you I deal with so here. many women at work. Mm -hmm. Is it hard for you to, for example, if there was a woman out in the world that you liked or you had interest in, does your experience at work affect your judgment of that woman? Like, are you coming into it kind of with work trauma almost? I don't know how to put it, but... Biases, I guess what I'm saying. Um, because you deal with kind of so many taboo, like maybe a toxic little bit. women. Maybe a little bit, but I feel like I was pretty, uh, from my own dating experiences, I was pretty. Did you date aware. a lot? Yeah, I've dated a lot. Like younger years, all the way up until now, or was there like a certain season throughout, that you dated? Throughout my whole life, you dated a lot. Yeah. I'm gonna let the rest come through, though. Big Sass Energy donated $30.
Apologies, if 500 is the standard to mute a mic, it should be reduced greatly for Desiree. Let's set it at 20. Think of the revenue. You could have her on every episode and make $20 every 10 minutes. That is true. That Old is, man that is a Marie but, donated but $1, $30. But $1,000 is still more than that, right? Anissa, like 10 out of 10. 10 tenths sounds weak. Well, guys, I have to go. Oh, we're about to finish. Can okay. you just wait like five yeah. minutes? We're gonna. Yeah, sure. I promise we'll sure, wrap sure, in like sure. five minutes. Uh, let's see. Josh donated $30. You know as much shit as I give you, Desiree. I'll at least admit you're a good sport. You're a horrible person, but at least a good sport. Alpha Lucy and Alpha Viv for nothing. making excuses. Mm-hmm. Stay dumb, Jinji. Yeah, thank you, man. Mommy Jim Jim underscore you who donated $30. Desiree, how much Bruh. would pay to like the cheese from That's under crazy. Brixen's fat canopy? Is Andrew back? The trans girl, good for you. Even though that reinjection of Estra made your brain go standard women overestimating yeah, value. GMD Jim donated $30. Yeah, thank you, man. Men don't want a high thank body you. count women like they don't want a plummeting stock. It is just a bad investment in their future. Women, keep your investment valuable and legs closed. Mm. Yo, Jim, thank you for the uh, message, man. Really appreciate it. Uh, I actually do kind of want to give a little props to Desiree. She's a good sport, and uh, she wasn't as bad. Still bad. No. Still bad. No. She was no. not. No. She was not as I'm bad. I'm trying to evolve. I'm trying she to. She was more not manage. as bad. She still interrupted a fuck ton and was kind sorry. of annoying. Whatever. I'm but. Sorry. It was better than last time. You did better than last time. I'll give you that. I'll give you that a little much credit. Baby steps. It's a standard steps. now that, oh, she just didn't happen to fucking I drop mean, her pants to try to I show you her. Is that, right, is that so. our new standard that, for the conduct on whatever? That yeah, is the that. new That's You the new standard. suck, Desiree. You've always sucked. Uh-oh. You're the worst. Oh, Can't boy. even believe you're on the show. Oh, boy. Everybody here deserves to be suck. here Wait. except you. Wait, how do I do it? Damn, brutal. Oh. That's kind of suck. Okay, I can't even do that. I'm trying to do the innuendo. But I All right, can't. guys. Uh, if you want, get your last last call on the uh, roast TTS. Last call, guys. I'm going to write last call. Uh, last call, guys. Streamlabs.com slash whatever. Streamlabs.com slash whatever. If you want to get your last thing in. Uh, Austin, Austin, can you pull up Twitch, please? Yeah. All right, guys. Go to twitch.tv slash whatever. Drop us a follow and a prime sub if you have one. Guys, it's a quick, free, easy way to support the show every single month. Every single month, guys, you can uh, drop us a follow. Uh, well, you can only one time drop us a follow, but every month you can drop us a prime sub. Uh, I'm going to do a redirect to Andrew. We're going to do a Twitch raid. Guys, drop us a follow on the prime sub. Classic World of Warcraft. Thank you for the prime man one minute ago. Slaying bodies. Thank you for the prime, Big man. Sass Energy donated $30. How do I do An eight-hour show at $20 mutes for 10 minutes is $1,000 a show. Desiree can literally print money and she could never talk. So she's just on the show every time, <laughs> but she pretty. just never talks. I just look pretty. That's actually kind of ge- can like I, evil genius. Can I like sit in the middle of the table eh, some of the time? I mean, I, mean, I feel like I need to be able to rotate around. The table might break. My back. Could not Are you happen. calling me fat now? No. I am a size six, okay? It could break. I Don't am trying to support was... the healthy weight oh, of American women. Oh, she was bad. Women. Not as bad as her, the previous panel appearance. So, thank you, man. David Tuzekciak donated $30. Saw Brian and Desiree go to the bathroom at the same time. You have to New subscribe video. to see. Desiree, <laughs> legally change your last name to Atlas already. Welcome, mad sister. I write it in my diary. <laughs> Desiree Atlas. Desiree yeah. Atlas. Desiree, you know, I'm trying to manifest it yeah. with my um, soulmate sketch. That Actually, I, I do. <laughs> Whatever the fuck, psychic though. You know what? I do want to. Um, I do also. <laughs> Desiree with the astrology. I don't Desiree know. brought like goodies. I did. I brought this. She brought. She brought like stuff in the yeah, bathroom, like I did. toiletries. I, I brought, like you know how you go to a nice and, club or something and they have a bathroom attendant with stuff. Tuna. 
<laughs> well, I just had it left you over. The kids didn't like it. You brought boxed tuna. The kids can, didn't like can it. I thought pass somebody me might the tuna like it. Fucking box? I thought somebody she might want tuna, it. She brought tuna, bro. She, she, just pass I was it. supposed to buy the chicken salad kits for my daughter, and I accidentally bought tuna, and so nobody's eating it, and I just, just thought like I would share. So, look, this is what she brought. This I is, mean, those were like in the earthquake <laughs> packs when we were kids. Remember, guys? That's crazy. Come on, it's this is nostalgia. What she we're in the this fallout realm right now. Fucking nobody ate packs, Desiree. That's nobody crazy. ate fucking tuna packs when we were kids. I nobody did. fucking ate that shit ever. Listen, I've I have never, sensitive I've blood never sugar. Even I have eaten a lot of fucking protein. snack packs and bologna sandwiches, Desiree. They didn't eat fucking tuna. I have in insulin a, in resistance. A, in a box. I had to always happened. eat meat. I have to eat a lot of oh, meat. It's a, oh, oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> I really do. My friends know this about me. I'm kind of. Oh, um, it's in a can. I'm very okay. sensitive to carbs. I was like, what the fuck? I have insulin resistance. All right, resistance. here, do you want that? That's true. Okay. <laughs> yeah, enjoy. Enjoy the tuna in a can. And the... <laughs> 